What's up, Peep Squad? Peep Squad is in the building, baby. Please like, comment, subscribe, share the video. It'll be greatly appreciated. Let's get down to the situation. Let's talk about Greg Leaks, one of the greatest men on reality TV. And no one else could do it better than Greg Leaks, the way he carried himself, how humble he was, and how nice he was, and sophisticated and confident too as well. And also confident in his wife. And he was also a great father figure too as well, and a good businessman. So let's get down to the situation. As you guys know, everyone has been praying for Greg Leakes. Everybody wants Greg Leakes, you know, to be victorious in this situation and beat cancer and continue his life journey and continue helping others and spreading his knowledge and his jewels. But in any event, we are praying. And a lot of people understand what Nene Leaks is going through and they really feel bad. Their heart goes out to Miss Nene Leaks. They it just really touched people because Greg has touched us on TV. Just the way he carry himself, how calm he is, how cool and how collective that he is too as well. But it's just so sad and it's heartbreaking too as well for each and every one of us and some of us don't even know Greg personally but we feel like we do because we watched him on TV for years him coming to our homes on our televisions or our cell phones you know Greg lived it up Greg was a good man Greg supported NeNe Leakes and if he had to stand next to her beside her behind her he was okay with that he wasn't jealous he wasn't envious of her at all point blank period he showed you the true essence what a black man is supposed to be when it comes to being a husband and a father an entrepreneur a ph ph philanthropist excuse me but Nene posted to Instagram, she's broken, you know, her heart is broken, that's her, you know, that's her backbone, you know, but Greg will always be a part of Nene Leak's, you know, backbone, and, you know, everyone's just like, Lord, I can't believe this, because, you know, we just knew that um, everything was going to be all right, we didn't know how deep the situation was when it comes to Greg and his cancer coming back and how serious that it is. And we watch Nene and Greg, you know, struggle through that on TV and open up their personal business, their life, their, you know, their health to us, you know, and that was absolutely wonderful. And we congratulate them on that because a lot of people ain't going to say ish about the situation. And we have seen that in the past with celebrities too as well. But we have Greg's son that's with Nene Leaks, you know. Um, basically, he had to post the Instagram to tell people, Pop's taking a nap. I am going to check on the lounge. He got to let people know what he's doing because people are assuming just because, you know, he's at the lounge or Nini's at the lounge, the Lanithia lounge, that they don't care about Greg. No, Greg would want them to handle business because he would want them to be fruitful and create more business and more business and plus having his baby son running a business too as well. And just this, because people got questions of why Nini's out, why she's smiling because she still got to put food on the table. You know what I mean? So does her son. Like the world don't stop because we going through stuff and that's the saddest thing that we all as people have to realize but in any event that did let us know yesterday that Greg is still alive he said pop is taking a nap I am going to check on the lounge so basically he said pop sleeping right now he's resting I'm about to hit the lounge up so don't don't mess with me you know don't try to discourage me you know what I mean and also letting people know because people were out here spreading rumors that Greg has departed and he has not yet. As of yesterday, Greg is still here and we want him here forever and ever. So just to let you guys know on that update too as well and let's get to kenya moore kenya moore you know kenya moore and nene leaks have their differences but kenya moore took to her instagram page and basically said that greg is a good man and yes he is a good man and you know she posted you know this about greg because she was touched by Greg too as well. She worked with him. So she understood what kind of good man that he was. A good husband, a good father, a good provider. And also a good assistant too as well. But Kenya Moore, she jumped on the Instagram and saying, praying for Greg at Nene Leaks and their family. Even through 
all our ups and downs. Greg never treated me differently. He was always kind and respectful. And that's coming from Kenya Moore. So you know that you know how we feel about Greg is real because that's what he displayed. You know, reality TV didn't break him down or make him look like a bad man. No, it didn't. And made him look the opposite, a good man. And Kenya Moore is calling him a good man. And when Kenya Moore says you're a good man, you already know. Especially if she's beefing or was beefing with your wife. But in any event, that was very nice of Kenya Moore to put her differences aside. And show love to NeNe Leakes. They know they knew each other for a long time. And also, we got Cynthia Bailey. Cynthia Bailey steps in, you know. And after Nene made the post, you know, broken. Like, her heart is broken. This is her husband and everything. You have Mallory. Mallory came through, you know, and basically showed Nene some love, too, as well. And you had Cynthia Bailey. Cynthia Bailey jumped in. She said, so sad and by this news sending you and your family love support and prayers like she came through for nini leaks nini leaks and acts for she don't you know she don't need it but it's wonderful you know just to get the support from people that you did business with people you were friends with people you stood side by side with phaedra parks even came out and also monique samuels came out to support Nene Leakes in her comment section on Instagram. Giselle Bryant, even Marlo Hampton came through too as well. And they have their differences. Lala came through. So, you know, Nene Leakes and Greg Leakes all loved out here in these streets. We had Shamari DeVoe come through. And also Nicki Minaj, the queen, come, came through. Portia Williams came through. Tamar Braston came through. You know, Tamar and Nene are good friends. You know, so it, it, it's just a wonderful situation just to see the support that Nene Leaks have out here in these streets. And much love to Nene Leaks, much love to Greg Leaks, much love to their children, to their family, and the support that they need that they will get. And they will be victorious and they will heal in this situation because it just saddens us all because Greg is a really good dude and it's really hard to come by really good dudes that have a foundation, a solid foundation and also have morals, values and he reminds you of what the, you know, the old school ladies, the seasonal woman, you, you know, your, you know, your grandmother and your auntie would describe men of their time or the man that they, you know, fell in love with and the characteristics of a good man, you know, and Greg embodied all of that. And we love you, Greg. We love you, Nene Leaks, and we send in healing and peace to your family. Peace and love to all my peeps and my peoples. Peep Squad is in the building. Please like, please comment, please share the video. It'll be greatly appreciated. Appreciate it. But one thing we didn't see, I didn't see Candy Burris. I don't know if Candy Burris was in the comments and it was just too far down. But Cynthia Bailey jumped in, you know, um, Nene Leak's comment as soon as she posted, broken. You know, her heart was broken, you know, prayers because her heart's broken. And also Mallory was right there right away too as well. And also Marlo Hampton, like right after Nene posted, they post on her post because they're watching. We love Greg. So you guys let me know what you think. Peace and love.